Here's a quick guide on how to use the flood selection tool to remove a background from an image on Affinity Designer for the iPad. First up, you're going to have to load up your image. We've got a bitmap image here. Let me zoom in, show you the pixels. And we're going to remove this background. So we're going to jump over to the pixel persona, come down to flood selection, and we're going to make sure that we've got our layer selected and tap on this background and then go over to the trash can to delete it. Make sure when you're using this technique though that all your edges that you want to keep are solid as I've not done that on the school and you'll see where this line is open it's deleted the internal part of the image. And Affinity does offer you some control of your selections. Let's just pick up this background in the uh, logo there, the red. And I can come over to this icon here and grow shrink selection. And then you've got a slider which allows you to manually change the position. Although I find that quite difficult to use because it um, seems to be very fast. Let's just tap on the numbers and open this little index. And we can use the numbers there with a lot more control over what you're selecting. If you'd like to see another video where I use the flood selection tool in more detail, I'll leave a link in the description.